All right, guys, what's up? Matrix RC, back out with another video. And what you see, I'm working on my X01 because we're going to get that 100 miles per hour with just the stock tires and stock everything. Um, that's all. Only thing I did that was modified was change the plugs. I don't run Traxxas plugs, um, but still stock. Got speed gear in there and speed pinion. So. Just so, one of the issues that was going on is the body, okay? Um, the body was rubbing here and on the back, especially the back. Uh, so I trimmed out the edge here. So that's gonna be bigger on both sides. I didn't cut everything out, but I just wanted to get it off of rubbing the wheels, okay? And I trimmed out just a little bit on the front, just so it will be flush with these uh, side canards here. That helps with the downforce. Um, so next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna trim the side skirt off here. Cause you see it is rubbing on that part, on both sides. The tires are expanding and blowing up so much that it's, it's ridiculous. So I'm just gonna lower this front a little bit more. All right. But let me go ahead and get my Dremel and uh, let's get that going. I'm going to take off about this much. Probably normally you probably want to take the tire off because you don't want to cut the tire. how much we're going to take off all right and I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to do the same thing to the other side and then I'm going to smooth it out with that and then we can have it in there but just so you can see see how much gap we got in there now just about a finger lift it's the same on the front too as well they did make enough space on the front but they didn't do it in the rear and these things gonna, are going to balloon and hit that. So now we got enough space. I'm gonna do repeat the same thing on the side, clean it up, and I'll be right back. So just so you can see, this is how much we took off. Just took off that much, and a little bit on the rear for the body. That's it. Okay, so there we go. I got my uh, side skirts, I got that all cleaned up. And I got the uh, body trimmed. And another thing, as you already know, we having some range issues with this remote. I'm gonna go in, take uh, check that antenna, and see if I can extend it out even longer and see if we can boost that range a little bit. All right, so I went in and ex extended the uh, antenna as far as I could. All right, put this back in. Everything's clean, I don't see no damages on the tip or anything like that. But I did go ahead and cut that tube open a little bit. And um, there we go. Got a longer antenna, so hopefully that helps with the poor signal. And um, man, uh, but why I do have it open right now, I just want to say something for a vehicle for this at this price point. There's a few things they should have uh, had done. It's my opinion. Because um, this is my first X01. Um, they should have put in the, the 2255 400 ounce servo. Uh, for a 100 mile per hour car, you don't want to put a, a cheap. 2075 plastic servo on here. That right there is, uh, I don't know, I guess they, you know, cutting down the price. 
that servo right here is cost like 30, 40 bucks. The, the red one would cost you a hundred, um, $90, a hundred dollars, which I would put a metal gear in here for this. So it's the fact that it's plastic gears on this is another, um, you know, way in cutting corners. Let's get it, man. Let's get this hundred mile per hour. Stop. All right, guys. I'll catch y'all guys later. Peace. Thank you.